Yes, we are. We are. How you doing? Nicholas, how are you? I'm well. What are you going to do for us today? Uh, telling jokes. All right. I'm Tom Cotter. I'm from New York City. I'm a uh, stand-up comic. I've been doing comedy for about 23 years now. I perform at all the comedy clubs in New York City, but I think I've just flown below the radar. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. The sound of how well the exes actually makes me I think so. I know. I have three boys and I have a wife, so I have three small mouths to feed, and so I have to make a certain amount of income. And doing comedy, it's not that easy. So this is big. Comedians don't generally do that well in this competition, but uh, I really think that my act is so different that I have to think that this is my year. We're always here to support fellow comedians. Go out there and give them what Tell you the got. audience that. I know, right? Good evening. How are you? I'm well. Good. What's Thank your you for name? asking. I'm Tom. Tom Cotter. And what are you going to do for us? I'm a stand up comic. Let's see what you got. All right. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Thanks, everybody. I'm the youngest in my family. I was always getting beaten up by the two oldest, mom and dad. And. <laughs> I used to get smacked around by these green berets that lived in our neighborhood. Some people call them Girl Scouts, whatever. <laughs> the morning of my 16th birthday, my whole family tried to surprise me with a car, but they missed. And uh, every Saturday morning in our neighborhood, we would have this huge water balloon fight. And every Friday night, I'd put mine in the freezer, so I'd win. And after that, all the mothers in the neighborhood would take turns spanking me. It was awesome. Uh, in high school, I got caught shoplifting once from a car dealership. It was a Buick. And my father <laughs> said to me through the bars of the jail cell, because he was in the next cell, he said, you're no son of mine, which hurt me, and it confused my mother. She was like, damn it, how did he know? I was a bad kid. I would sneak over to my neighbor's house late at night, and I would bounce up and down on their trampoline. That was their daughter's name, Arlene. And... That's my time, everybody. Thank you very much. Wow. Yeah, you're funny. Well, you delivered. Thank you. And your timing is great. It was one laugh after another. It was really, really wow. spot on. So congratulations, because you made us laugh. Oh, you're very kind. Thank you. I appreciate the kind words. You know, with so many comics who come on here, I find myself doing that fake laugh, because I am pulling for them, I'm rooting for them. With you, it was genuine laughs. I can tell you've got a ton of material behind you. Tons. You're excellent. Wow. And thank you for being on the show. Wow. Mean it. I'll be honest with you, Tom. I, I, I don't know you. I've never seen you before. I do stand-up comedy myself. I'm a and, big fan. Well, thank you so, so much. Now I am a big fan of yours. But I would guess you've been doing this for a while. 23 years. Well, you know what? In a it, row. <laughs> you know what? It shows because you are polished, you are confident, you're wow. the consummate performer, wow. you're funny, I know who your character is, and your notoriety has just gone up tenfold, and people are going to love you and hire you yeah, in America. Unbelievable. All right, we can go. Howie. It's a yes for me. Uh. Howie. It's a yes. And we will see you in Vegas. It's a yes. Ah! Hug a man, will ya? Unbelievable. Wow. Explain his feeling to me right now. I can't. This is, uh, it's uh, way up there. This is birth of my children good. This is wow. really good. This is... I'm, I'm flabbergasted. I think we found a star, and a star that has been in the making for an entire lifetime. I am just humbled. I'm just humbled. It's the most humbling night of my life right now. And I really, I do think I could lose it, and I can't right now. Uh.